Next question I want to ask is manhood in a capitalistic society is based on your ability to earn. Definitely, yeah. By default, unfortunately, we're dealing with black men because there are many white men in other groups that uh, fall into this place. But in regards to black men, based on how the system is set, it seems like they're already denied the ability to partake in manhood in this country. Yeah. What are your thoughts on that? Because of their financial situation? Yes. Yeah. I mean, th that's true, and I don't see how that's going to improve. Um, now, throughout history in this country, as you said already, your ability to earn and take care of your family has really been the primary way that we define manhood. Um, and for since the beginning, African-American men, for various reasons, have been denied that opportunity. It, uh, you know, by and large, uh, you know, uh, they've been denied that opportunity. Um, the question is, you know, given that that's the case, what are the other avenues available to assert or affirm one sense of manhood? And in this environment that we have now, I don't know what those are. Um, now, you could say, you know, um, some men are saying, even if I, if I can't earn, be a more involved father, uh, be more involved in the household. But the data, for instance, I read this study years ago that suggested that um, even when men are unemployed or they're not going to school, these are men, you know, family men, married men with children. Even when they're uh, not working, they're not going to school, they spend most of their time taking care of themselves, not, <laughs> not of their families or the children, or doing community work. Um, whether that's the case in the African American community, I don't know. It probably is. But, you know, what are the other avenues to achieve a sense of manhood? when the financial avenue is available. And I don't know, what, because culturally we don't have those. It's always been this one way. And now the other issue is, you know, as women are earning more and are more out of the household even more, um, again, it causes a challenge to how, what other ways men can achieve a sense of manhood. I don't know how they can. Um, it's a cultural issue. And the problem is, it's not just black men facing this now, it's white men as well. Um, so in terms of what the solution is, uh, given that, uh, those old industrial jobs that used to be available aren't there anymore, given the, the role that women are playing now as being earners in the home. I don't know what the solution is to that. Um, so we, we would have to really figure out what other avenues can be available for men to achieve a sense of manhood. And outside of being a breadwinner and taking care of your family and being viewed as being a, a man based upon what you can purchase, what you, what you, can, what you can buy, um, I, I really don't know what those other options are available to men. There aren't any, to be honest. There aren't many, at least, uh, to be honest.